and we could see that we do retrieve an error message and let's try to do this again to see what happens and it looks like something is going on with this i don't really know what that error message means exactly maybe we could try to put something else so for instance we could put something like tables so something that we can also try is just putting a zero here and seeing and it looks like that did work so now we can see that it does reflect on to the page and what we could do here is we can try to extract information from the database since now we can see the information coming from the column so in this case we'll just put something like union select name and then we'll keep the nulls maybe we'll try to do from let's do sqlite master where type is equal to table and let's see if that works and we could see here that we do retrieve a flag table, select flag. And then instead of doing SQLite master, we'll just get rid of that and then just supply it with flag with the couple dashes. And we could see here that we do retrieve the flag. We did not do error-based. We ended up doing it through union-based injection.